Okay, so what we're going to be looking at today is a microphone kit. Professional video and broadcast microphone kit. So it's a pretty good uh, little microphone kit. It's got 13 pieces. You can find it on the internet. It's pretty well priced. It's a really good bargain if you want good audio. So most of these people use this for video. You can use it for anything. You can use it into a regular recording board. But it's really made for video. So you can plug it into your camera. So let's look at this kit. It says it's got 13 pieces. It's got your mic. It's got a shock mount. It's got cords. It's got, uh, it even comes with a battery. It's got your headphone jack adapter. It's got a shoe for the uh, top of the camera. I'll explain that for you. And it's even got a microphone holder. So let's look at this. Uh, let's open up this kit here. So I'm going to turn it upside down and open up this way so we can just look at it. So here it is. And as you can see, they cram a lot of stuff in this little box here. A lot of stuff. And it's not a big box, but it's it's a pretty good size box. I mean, here's a regular pen, so you can kind of see what, you know, household pen, so you can kind of see what size it's like. It's, you know, how big it is. So let's look at what it comes with in here. So, let's see. It comes with, with some cables, some XLR cables, which are these kind of connectors. And it also comes with your, your little extra... XLR adapter because this end will go into the camera, this little end here, and this end will go into the cord. So this is actually an adapter. So you get from three prong here, XLR, to eighth inch. So let's put that aside. And then we got like the regular cable. This is a regular XLR cable. And you know, it's a pretty good size. I think it's 25 feet, this one. So it looks pretty decent. For coming in the kit so we'll put it over here and then you got a, a swivel for a microphone you can just put this into a mic stand as you can see it screws on and then the microphone goes on here so we'll put that aside there's your battery and you know it doesn't come with an expensive battery but it's enough to get you started let's put that aside then you also got a holder comes with a holder right here that you could screw on to the mic. I'll show you how that works. You get this and you could screw the holder on here when you take this off. And you could just use the mic as a as a regular, uh, you know, as a handle for the mic. So we'll put the handle here on the side. And then let's take a look at the mic itself. It's a condenser mic, which is pretty good. And a regular shotgun mic as you can see and what's cool about this kit too is it comes with a shock mount which is like whatever vibrations you have on your camera or whatever this little shock here will absorb the this little shock mount will absorb all the movement and all the noise so you won't have a lot of noise happening when you're moving the camera around and then it also comes with a a little swivel here and you can mount the shoe on here where you can put on on the uh, shoe mount on the camera and I'll show you how to do that in a second show you how that works and like I said this is the the mic itself and let's look at this yep it's a condenser mic as you can see and it's a shotgun mic that's what it says and it's phantom power so that's why you need the battery to power it and the way you open it up is you just open it up right here and you put the battery in after you open it let's see let's unscrew it the battery goes there in that little slot right there and you put the battery in it and you close it back up and then the most important thing, I even, a lot, a lot of times I mess up, make sure that it's on. There's an on and off switch right there. Make sure that you turn it on or else it won't work. There's your off switch. 
and there's your on switch and this switch up here is a it cuts down your bass that's what that's for if it's windy or you don't want any any pops in your audio it's good to use that it's not as full but it cuts down all the pops but the main thing is just to have it on so that's how that works so that's the mic let's put that over here and then it comes also with some more stuff we're not done yet boy it comes with a lot and then it has a cat filter we call this a cat they call this a cat because it I guess it has fur like a cat and this goes over the mic when it's windy so it's a filter so you put it on the mic like so open it up put it in the mic it's got like a little elastic thing on there so you might have to put it on there open it up so it fits on there and then you just kind of roll it up in there like this just put it on make sure it's open and this is like brand new so I've never really put it in there so let's see so now it's in there let's see if it'll go in let's see we're trying we're trying and it looks like it's going in but like I said it's new so it's gonna take a while here it is and that's what it looks like with it on so that's supposed to take a lot of the wind noise especially when you're filming outside so let's take this off now now that we got it on see if it'll come off just twist it off there we go so that's a one type of filter so that's one type of filter let's say this is back on there yeah that's one type of filter and then we got another another one which is this one which is uh, this is like an indoor thing it's it cuts uh, wind noise also but it's just a different type of filter so this is more of an indoor type filter when there's extraneous noise and you want to filter that out sometimes this works really good so that's one how that one works and it even has some extra little o-rings for the shock mount here like I said this is the shock mount over here like little rubber bands so these are like extra little rubber bands that it comes with so that's that pretty good stuff for this little package and it's priced really reasonable so I would get this if you're in need of a of a microphone for your videos if you want really good audio because I've used this in the audio and this is pretty excellent so thanks a lot and well let me show you real quick how to put this on the camera here's a Canon DSLR camera that I just have uh, around here and so there's the shoe on top of it so all you do is put the camera in position right get your shoe slide it on there like that and tighten it up so that's all it does it just goes right in this this little thing right here you just take it off like this then you just slide it on see it's a little type of thing you just slide it on there like that so it's pretty easy take it off slide it on and it's ready to go and of course you have to make your connections tighten this up and there it is and the microphone's there so there's your connections so let's put this cable here we don't need the long one so we'll put this short little cable here we'll connect line up the pins connect it once we line up the pins there see line up the pins and connect it then we'll do the audio inside in the camera so we'll do the audio for the camera and here's the thing here's the end pin the eighth inch adapter from this and this will go into the audio so the audio on this camera is in the side panel right here as you can see there's a side panel with an audio input 
for a mic. So you put it in there, boom, the mic's in there. So that's all there is to it. And then what happens is that bypasses your uh, your internal mic on the camera, and you're using this new mic. Okay, hope you enjoyed it, and see you next time.